So I think many people look at blockchains a very wrong way in, in the crypto market. They look at price performance as a definition of whether something is successful or good tech, and that could not be further from the truth. We've seen some coins explode, do exceptionally well, but yet they continue to have some major flaws. And there are some up and coming chains, there are some, some fast transaction chains that have been launched that have done well, but even one of the most hyped up chains as of late has faced a major flaw, and this is why Cardano is going to win in this market cycle. I'm Luxide, welcome to the channel. If you guys are new or haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below, hit that bell again, it's free to do. It'll keep you updated anytime there's new content live here on the channel. So first of all, before we get into uh, this, this big, big news, I have to say that ADA wants to continue to, to move up, all right? It's pushing 80 cents again, it's looking really good, and I, I'd love to see us just keep stacking these green days together. What's interesting about this is right now, even though the daily is overbought, even though the weekly is overbought, if you guys haven't noticed, the four hour has actually cooled down. The one hour even has cooled down, which means that we may actually have the potential to have a little bit more legs here. We may see ADA starting to get a little wild again and trying to push the upside of our trend here, set a new cycle high again. This isn't a guarantee. This isn't financial advice. We'll wait and see what happens. And again, as you guys know, I still have my longs open. Open. That hasn't changed. It's up 1400% right now, 1450%. Again, I'd love to see this just keep climbing. This has been open since September 2nd. There have been a lot of people using Margex to trade with leverage. Again, feel free to check out those links in the description below if you guys would like to do so. There's no KYC. You can earn up to uh, $10,000 in deposit and trading bonuses. So why I'm, why I'm mentioning that Cardano is so far ahead of everything else from a technical aspect is you see a lot of these these newer chains coming out that that tout, oh, it's I'm the Solana killer, I'm the ETH killer, I'm gonna do uh, all these different things, but then they continue to have the same problems time and time again. Now, this isn't to dog on other chains or anything like that, but this is why I've said that tech is so hard to get right. Sui, something that has been an up and coming chain, that price performance has been exceptional, that I, I've seen some people say, oh yeah, I'm dumping, you know, dumping my ADA to move to Sui. It just faced some some downtime. No blocks produced for more than an hour, and this was this was posted earlier today. And if you guys haven't noticed, this has been a very um, consistent trend amongst a lot of blockchains. Solana has had downtime. Avalanche was doing quite well. People were saying Avalanche was going to be the next big thing. Face downtime. Sui, up and coming chain, very exciting. Face downtime, but yet they all have these consistent themes, and Cardano does not. Now, why is that? It's because Cardano took the slow road, the right road, they built everything correctly. And that is why right now we're seeing Cardano be talked about, being talked about in some of the biggest ways throughout the world. Big government partnerships, enterprises tapping the Cardano blockchain, even much bigger potential use cases coming down the line that are under NDA currently. And that's that's the reason why Cardano is going to win. That's the reason why you're going to see something this cycle, the likes of which you have never seen before. It's it's just that much bigger and more well prepared for mass adoption, for actual government and enterprise adoption than pretty much any other blockchain out there. Yes, there are some others that that are being talked about in a big way. Uh, Ripple, uh, eight, uh, Hedera, right? There, there's some other ones that are doing good things. And I've never said that Cardano has to run it all. It's a chain that's trying to and it's best prepared for it. But the point is, is this is why Cardano won't be um, won't be usurped. This is why Cardano won't fade away like people are talking about. And this is the why when Cardano does in fact gain some major retail traction, which I believe is coming very soon here, it's it's going to be unstoppable, okay? Now, this isn't a guarantee or anything like that. Nobody knows what's going to happen in this market cycle, but you're starting to see that that retail buzz, which is what Cardano has lacked in a big way, start to pick up. You're seeing it from a price performance aspect, which again, hopefully ADA continues to run and do quite well here. You're, you're beginning to see it from um, a, a whale aspect, right? We, we've obviously seen whales on the heavy accumulation and just continuing to adding. You're even seeing it on the institutional money side, which I wish I had this pulled up, but Cardano saw some of the most significant gains from institutional money. And you don't even have a, a Cardano or a ADA ETF yet. I mean, th this movement that's gonna hit Cardano is in fact so big. And there are so many people that still aren't paying attention to it. 
it's starting to be discussed. People, I, you know, we've seen obviously content creators start making more content about ADA, but I want you guys to remember, you know, obviously who is <laughs> who was here during the bear market cycle, who, who was talking about the Cardano tech, the Cardano development, ADA as a, a price standpoint before things began to get exciting. We saw the vision early, and this is why those who accumulated during times that price was down significantly, they have been rewarded so far the most and will be rewarded well, Wow, I can't speak. Rewarded the most in the long run. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Let me know your thoughts below. Do you think Cardano is going to see a big boom of retail adoption? Do you think it's going to continue to be tapped in such big ways when it comes to government and, and enterprise? And do you think Cardano has a chance to become the most dominant blockchain in crypto? Appreciate you guys. Have a great day. Show your love below. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Take care.